Hey you folks, Quilly Team here, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Crusader Kings 2! Got all the expansions up to and including Jade Dragon, but we are playing as the Count of Paris. It's been a hard time! We had the king trying to revoke her title, we had to rebel against him. We've had smallpox, our son had smallpox, our wife died of cancer. It's rough here in the, um, in the 8th century, but so far we're taking on. Uh, king Carloman has created the Duchy of Champagne. Hmm, yeah. Still would like to get up to a, a ducal level title if we can. Waiting for the um, the epidemic to move a little further away here. I guess the epidemic's no longer there. It's not officially epidemic level, so I guess we'll open the gates at this point. Even though smallpox is still lingering around. Child count. Hmm. Maybe we should fabricate here. Now, with Gavilkind Succession, we will lose that county later. Um, like, we won't rule it directly, but it'll still be a family member. And that's okay. Again, we're going, you know, sort of a long-time plan here. To spread things around. Oh, man, there's a lot of people that died. There's so many young people going on here. Um, we could go on an assassination spree. What, what is this? There's like a... A tombstone. Oh! Because minor depopulation. Now, we made it through without that, which is good. Uh, as a reigning count, I rarely have any spare time. But for my little son, Paul Mark, I would move heaven and earth. Hey, that's the second son that I love and we have a good relationship with. Oh, that's wonderful. That's really nice. It makes me so happy. My wife is pregnant. Uh, excellent. This is my second wife. Um, the first one did die of cancer, but not after giving me two sons, including one that she bore while, while sick with cancer. I mean, holy crap, man. That is... That is impressive. All right, this war is about to end. What? Oh, there it is. And we had a message for a second, but it went away. And rebellion. Okay, so what's going on here? Um, West France in revolt for... Oh, it, the Prince Theodoric wants to become the ruler here. Or, you know, a faction trying to support him. Um, and Thomas the Cruel. Wait, hold, King Pepe, hold on. Oh, my liege died! So he's got... There are two wars with exactly the same purpose, to put Prince Theodoric on the throne. Hmm. I should probably just stand by, rather than spend money on troops. <clears throat> On the other hand, having a child on the throne might be a little easier to manipulate. If the rebels win, they might... No, I don't think it matters where people necessarily rule from. <clears throat> you know what? I'm just going to sit tight. It's going to be fine. Paris current crown focus. Um, do we have a claim on Amiens? They're part of the rebellion right now. That's interesting. I will use it. Can't declare war on you now. And you're sieging me? Seriously? Oh. Well, all right. I guess that's just going to happen. So we're going to lose some of our um, some of our prosperity. We're going to use that claim after this because it should just be a count on count battle within a kingdom we got another daughter there you go. two sons two daughters perfectly balanced well so everyone say hello to our new daughter joel wodo joel wodo thank you very much for your support of that excellent uh cause no we have another sickly child you must attempt to save my joel wodo you must and we're gonna put you um with, uh, we're gonna put you with struggle. Just, you know, vary it up. Seems that whatever treatment has administered has worked. This guy's really good. He does have 21 learning. Ugly, which is unfortunate. 21 learning. No difference, so the sickly went away right away. That's great. So yeah, we're gonna be sieged down. Hopefully no one cat cakes as prisoner or something weird like that. I could try to raise my troops now, but... We don't have enough. Even if they didn't rise up with, like, no morale or anything like that. Uh, young Matt Fred finished his education in the way of wars. I noticed the pride. 
Uh, so whoever this is, is a brilliant strategist. Well, that's excellent. Matt Fred impressed everyone with sensible choices. Great uh, ability for self-restraint. We're going to make him just. So there we go. So this is one of my courtiers over here who is, yeah, very good. Defeat over here. You're going to siege everything out. Siege of Paris. Okay, none of us are apparently taking prisoners, so. I don't know what this is going to end up looking like. Man, there's a lot of civil wars in this time. Really not like a strong presence on the throne. Alright, I think they're done. I think they've taken everything. I could raise some vassal levies, but I'm assuming I can't retake it. I want to go and just bop these guys. There you go. Let's do it. Wap, wap, wap. Um, I creeps. Oh, I'm okay. Losing the trait gregarious. My court physician suggests I buy him some new equipment for his la laboratory. Uh, probably allowed him to raise his skill. You know what? He deserves it. Ten gold. He deserves it. He's been doing such great stuff for us. Yeah, there's no way we can reclose. I'll go and stand on Paris again. Uh, he gained two more learning! Yes! Oh, look, okay. he's actually at a 26 right now. fan frickin -tastic. Oh, I can move you out of here at this point. I'm going to move you to Orléans. Try to fabricate a claim over there. Actually, oh, another pregnancy. I wonder if I should just send him to one of the duchies. I probably should. He's got, I think he's got enough skill to do that. We can't move him right now. How skillful is my chancellor? Oh no, he's only twelve. I don't think he can fabricate on a uh, on a duchy with a twelve. Okay, we need some extra people. I can't hit this button right because we're not tribal or anything. Yeah, no. Yeah, we'll never retake this, but I don't know. We'll stand here anyway, because why not? Losing on three counts. I think the wars will, like, sort of kind of collapse pretty fast. Oh, this is someone else's claim. <gasps> yeah, another daughter! This daughter is going to be called... Uh, this daughter is going to be called Rob L. Rob L. There we go. Rob L. Our daughter. Rob L. <laughs> it just looks a little bit better. Rabel is going to be our daughter over here. Um, I've inherited the barony. Okay, that's quite nice, actually. So, one of these baronies. Where's our Where's our symbol? Oh, right. It's not going to show us. Montfort. This one right over here. This barony now belongs to us. So, we'll get the tax value from this directly. Um, so, you can see that the... Uh, I suspect, I'm not sure, uh, that might be just because we're, we're, you know, we've been taking the war, but I think we used to make like six gold from our first, uh, holding. Now it's down to four, but that's because we get all of it from here, I'm pretty sure. Um, newborn daughter, feeble little thing. All my children are born feeble. Alright, make an effort. You can do it. Open council position. I need a new chancellor. Alright, it's gonna be you. And... Got to fabricate a claim over there. Still appears weaker than most, but had successful treatment. That's going to be okay. Minor grantable thing. will um, This mayor over here... Yeah, we'll make him our regent. I think that's going to be okay. Get a relationship boost there that, as well. Uh, lost some of our troops there, apparently. Um, so my master went away. Whoa! Okay, he's angry because he's not on there. This mayor. He is ambitious, which might be dangerous, but it's also dangerous not to make him happy. Let's do it. That should make him a fair bit happier. Yeah, because it's a huge change from being unhappy about not having the position to now having it properly. Yeah, plus 10 from being our spy master. Um, that's going to be okay. I think I'm going to leave you at home to um, uncover plots right now rather than send you away to sniff out... Um, 
Byzantine technology. Maybe right just to retake this so that we were, you know, getting all of our money and stuff, because we're not right now. And we've got our troops raised. I should probably just lower them. They're not doing anything. There we go. Cut back on some of our expenses anyway. Child lacks focus. Ah, okay. So, Hunter Billico has finished his first round of education. He's haughty, futzy, and a brooding. Um, and then for a second round of education, we want to pick something where um, a good trait will help. So these are traits that are going to be, like, counterproductive. Here, there's a chance it'll use the right trait, but it's also got a bad one. So you're fussy, which gives you stewardship, and we'll give you an intrigue in education, because apparently that's a good combo. So you might become an excellent spy. Spy master after all this, which would be interesting to see. The Franks in the county of Paris have now adopted enough of Latin customs that they no longer be recognized as Germanic. The scholars call them French. Such are the times. Paris becomes French. King Pepin has made the Kingdom of Middle France his primary title. Okay. So, I mean, there's still a rebellion. I don't really know. I don't really know what's happening. There's still three wars going on. Everything is stripy in a bunch of different colors. I mean, we've got rebellion on rebellion over here. Although I don't think, I don't know if they're at war with each other. I'm just going to sit here and, and hope that, uh, that things are okay. Formed an alliance with King Taslo the Holy. King of Bavaria. Uh-huh. Oh, he's got the flu! Call for my court physician. My wife's pregnant again. Yeah, that's what we want. Although I could use more boys. Uh, ooh, did I just have a heart attack? Chest pains. How old am I? 50. Ooh. Fairly sure you're developing consumption. Alright. At least it's not cancer. Abstain from food. Sure, buddy. Whatever you have got to say. Excellent symptom treatment. Yeah. Oh, man. This is the greatest doctor. Every time I've had a doctor before for a disease, he's like, I'm going to cut off three of your body parts. And, oh, you still died. She's the as I did. Don't know much about medicine. Perhaps he's on something. He asked for some money to develop his theory further. Yes, absolutely. We're going to give you some more money. Because you're awesome. Also, speaking of money. Yes, I want a castle town for... More tax income. I don't know if it can be built while we're under siege, but we'll get it started anyway. Peasants in the local countryside have sent representative to petition for our support in for one of their traditional carnivals. Uh, we can afford it, lose 25 gold, or they're just peasants. We would lose just. I don't want that. I like just. Not that we have a lot of vassals, but it is a nice trait to have. So you guys are still cranky about your things. I don't have them raised right now, but you're right, cranky about have them having been raised. Fair enough. Oh, I guess the barony does affect our domain size. That's interesting. And fair. But yeah, we can give the barony to our son when he comes of age. Although, Gavilkind doesn't have the same pressure to have landed sons. Although, I will go and tick this on. So if I do give him a title... If I give him the barony, and then I die, does my primary heir get my county? I don't know. We have another daughter! Welcome, Aaron. All right, I mean, Aaron is also a girl's name, not spelled that way, but well, it's fine. We're setting, you know, it's the year 1784. We're writing the standards of naming convention. That's just the way that it is. As uh, Aaron, uh, Aaron Halvey, who sent in a, uh, a donation um, and got on this reward board. Thank you very much. So, another daughter. Is this one going to be sickly too? I don't know. Ooh, Hunter Villico is greedy. Eh, tax money. It's actually pretty good. Um, another war just started. I thought, did one end? No, no, no. Now we're in four wars. Okay. Although, the army of Pippin has taken over some... So, like, who's my heir right now? King Pippin. All right, so, Pippin, it'd be great if you could come and desiege Paris. Although, it looks like you're going to fight this guy, which I guess is okay. I don't even know who's supposed to be my king anymore. At this point, I'm just sitting at home, making babies with my wife, and hoping it all works out. I'm in Paris! We're going, we're, you know, drinking in, in cafes, having some croissants. Okay, croissants have probably haven't been invented yet, and we probably haven't imported coffee from, um, from Mocha yet. Which would be, which will be right here later on. So, yeah, I, I you know, 
Sure, fine. Oh, five wars! Excellent. Uh, Remdo published his work on the four humors. His ideas about black bile, phlegm, blood, and yellow bile, and how they can be manipulated to treat different ailments have been received well, or with, with much acclaim by scholars. So he is now a renowned physician. Awesome. I knew this was a good investment. I gained, and you as his patron are celebrated for your contribution to medicine, gain 100 prestige. Don't mind if I do. Prestige it has been nerfed a couple of times, but it's still a huge buff to relationships with everyone in the game when you're prestigious. Awesome. All right. Six kids. See, this is what I'm talking about. You know, could do it with a few more boys to help spread the dynasty a bit more. But uh, we'll do what we can. We will do what we can. What we might do is we... I mean, we might marry off a couple of daughters to see if we can set up um, non-aggression packs. That would be one thing. And then we might, for a couple, we might just look to matrilinear marry to anyone. Just as a way to uh, create more children of our dynasty. The anonymous dynasty. Which started with literally just me. I was the only person in the entire world of that dynasty. Or rather, started with 2E over here. As the only person of our dynasty. We can take a look at, like, our family tree. And there's, like, there's nothing. Our parents are just blank spots. Young Hunter Billico has shown... A mu much petty cruelty towards others. Ooh. You should show more ambition. This would make him ambitious, and I like that. Or, fine, I don't need more competition. Loses haughty, becomes cruel. No, no, no. Become ambitious. I want my heir to be ambitious, plus dude, all the things. Now, if his brothers also become ambitious, that might be bad. But so far, so good. Oh, we're down to only four wars now, you guys. Ooh. Selsa might fancy me. 38. No genetic anomalies. I'm lustful. I mean... Let's have some bastard kids. Let's do it. <laughs> We're gonna legitimize them. Have as many children as possible. My wife might be a bit pissed. This is the, uh, this is the ambitious wife? Oh no, she's not the ambitious wife. It's fine. Oh, she's well fed. Plus health. Good. Excellent. I'll trait you one woman. Family man, fertility. Where did I get this trait from? Is it because I took this? I mean, there must have been some sort of trigger, some sort of event. Uh, okay. Sword stood against... Word stood against word. The farmers against the courtiers about damage caused to the farmer's house by a cow owned by the courtier. Either I can... I guess I should just support my courtier. He's not particularly right. You know what? Farmer should be compensated. I'm just. He was not happy with the decision. Deal with it. Uh, okay. What do you want? Oh, appoint counselor. You would like me to be your chancellor. Oh, King Pimpin's come of age. Pepin. Pepin. Okay, I will be your chancellor. Important decisions. Do I have to recruit a new physician? No! And a chaplain as well. Okay, well, first of all, you want to be on the court. So that's fine. Um, uh, minor titles. No valid candidates. Ah! Alright, let's recruit someone else. Damn it! That guy's done so much for us. Your ranger's report of a suspected witch <gasps> living in the outskirts of the realm. Oh, wait, hold on. Oh, what's this? They have never been able to prove that the woman practices sorcery, although the villagers do not trust her. She's willing to put her medical mixology skills to use in your court and offers to become your physician in exchange for naught but a small vial of blood. A most strange offer. Um. Um. She's a mystic. An attractive mystic. How could I say no? Um. Oh, wait. Oh, I have a 10% chance of becoming infected. You know what? Let's do it. Okay, I'm not infected. Good. Uh, <laughs> this is interesting. I don't expect her to be as good as my last position, since she's only got a 13 instead of like, what was he, like 26 by the end? But still. My god, so many little wars. We don't care. Make more babies. Even if we have to sleep around. We should sleep around with the physician. See if we can get some attractive babies. How you doing, son? Greedy, ambitious, uh-huh. And Paul Mark? 
conscientious, willful idolizer. Hmm. All right. So we don't have any genetic traits in the family yet, but that's okay. Oh, I died! Uh, given up the ghost at the age of three, died clutching at his heart. Guilty of the sin of pride, wanted everyone to know of his greatness. A wicked man, Tui will surely pay for his sins in the afterlife. So I must have died from consumption, clutching his heart. I don't know. May have just been a heart attack. So, Hunter Billico, merely 15 years old. The realm was left in capable of the hands of the regent and council. Long live Count Hunter Billico. So be it. Um, yeah, my heir is my brother. I have a regent for a year. I guess I did keep both titles, actually. Despite the gavel kind. So the gavel kind might not be a, might not apply to the barony level stuff. Um, we are going to wait till, for us to come of age, and then we'll try to marry outright instead of arranging a marriage. Um, we still have an educator. Hopefully we'll work out okay. And council position. We need a new chancellor. You're ambitious. Um, oh, he's one of my loyalists. Let's actually assign a loyalist here. Now, I might have wanted to make some law changes in my previous life. Like, allow the revoked titles. I thought I would live a little longer and have more of an opportunity to suck up to them and make changes. We'll see. After supper, me and Celsa were forced to dishes, but I was clever and hid them until Celsa told on me, and now I have to do all of it. Unfair, I'll run away. We can become bitter rivals with this lady. Or stupid dishes. Oh, either way, become rivals. So, I'll just run away and gain some prestige. Sure. It's always funny to see the events that happen when, like, you're a kid. Because they're completely different. My council is discontent. Well, I mean, they have to listen to a kid, and they're not happy about that. The Regency has ended. Finish my education's way of intrigue. Fascinating subject. Never interrupt your enemy when he's becoming a mistake. So we're flamboyant schemer. Could be better, but it's okay. The more I think about it, the more I see how things are wrongfully denied me. So I will become envious. Not the best, but it is what it is. Um, that is an excellent mustache. 10 out of 10. Apparently, I've got a lot of intrigue. I could go even more intriguey and plan some assassinations and stuff. Um, we could go more family focus a little bit more to try to... Um, Keep spreading the genes. Although I don't think we need to worry about it that much. I'm actually thinking of going hunting. The health boost is quite nice. Marshall's not quite that important, but it's got some great events. We can hunt the white stag and stuff um, and get some permanent traits out of that. We will pick an ambition. Just acquire any title from the liege. We're going to go for this, actually. Not as easy as the raising the child, but we didn't finish it last time. All this war is not going to help for this, though. So, um, first, let's take a look at our liege. Yeah, you don't really have anything going on. Marriage ties. Huh. That's not helpful. Um... I don't know, my religion group. Let's expand it a little bit. Any chance we can find a genius? We can. 33-year-old. Another schemer. Genius. Gregarious, charitable, kind, craven, deceitful. We'll lose some prestige, but we start to introduce some genius into our ranks. Let's do it. See if we can get some uh, some genetics on our side. My council's still discontent. We'll unpause here. Paris is still sieged out. Uh, we will we will take the money. That money means a lot right now. Still, I mean, I don't suppose I can like encourage someone to like come. Here. Oh, I've got enough troops now to finally siege something back. Thank goodness, and then I can get more troops and more troops. Uh, my court chaplain sent me a gift. It's a puppy! Oh, a hunting dog, yes! Abs pay someone to get rid of it? What the hell's wrong with you? Yes, plus one diplomacy, plus one health. You can raise the dog up. Um, I will name the dog Hunter. Because I am, in fact, a hunter. Are you going to come and kick my ass? No, no, you're just going to siege that up. That's fine. 
Uh, child lacks focus. This is my brother. And looks like a good choice for you would either be learning education or stewardship education. We'll go with stewardship. Because if you get a title, this will make you much better at doing it. Now, what is our culture? We're still Frankish. Central Germanic. We might want to become French instead. Uh, we'll see. Oh, my wife is pregnant, but that can't be right, can it? I'm not paranoid or anything. Hmm. She is deceitful. That besets me. I don't know, man. I've thought over it cannot be the father of my wife's baby. As it grows in her belly, I have trouble sleeping. I must put this matter to rest. Let's hire someone to find out for five gold. I might still be willing to, like, take in this kid if he's a genius. Made a hire to gain my wife's uh, confidence has not found anything at all suspicious about her pregnancy. That's a relief. I am not paranoid, right? Envious, ambitious, greedy. Oh, I thought that was just something that triggered with paranoid. You would like me to be a commander. Sure, I'll accept. Come on, besiege. Uh, usurp the city of whatever. Okay, victory of a siege. That's my capital has been besieged now. Dog is growing quickly and is no longer a little puppy. He runs fast and has a keyed nose, and your dog handlers praise his good character. You get some prestige for having a good dog. Excellent. All right, we're going to sit around and de-siege a little bit more of our stuff around here. Famous writer proposed to compose your family chronicles. Of course we will give him our patronage. Make us proud. We could ignore him. We might become humble. All dynasty. Yeah, no. Give him the patronage. Proud and humble doesn't matter that much, but we can get some good buffs for it. That's going to be okay. And luckily, these two provinces are not adjacent to another, so we have time to maybe, like, disband if we start to get attacked. The Siege of Paris. Didn't give us any more troops to raise. Oh, it did, actually, so I will do that. We have another daughter over here, and she is a genius. Our genius daughter's name is going to be... Arixit. Arixit, our genius daughter. Nice. Okay. Yeah, if we can marry you off matrilinearly to someone who's a genius or something, well, that's never going to happen. But it would be nice, wouldn't it? Man, it could happen, I suppose. So we're going to de-siege ourselves. I mean, the war, one of our wars is going well, and other parts of our war are not going well. We fully de-sieged our land. We could actually go and beat up these guys. Steward, oh, special tithe, nice. Yeah, let's go and beat up these guys. We might be able to de-siege some land over there. Who knows? Maybe we'll have peace at some point. Oh, my commander was killed. Oh, well. <laughs> uh, it's Rubble! Who needs a childhood focus. Um, I, I might have to, like, assign a different educator. For things. We will, um... Here, we'll, we'll, we'll get you for thrift. I think we already did thrift with someone, though. Yeah, we did, actually. I think my... I want to say my brother. I think that might be true. So yeah, we'll just de-siege this. And I guess we're going to put a cut. I don't know. <laughs> we're helping! I don't, I don't think it matters, but... We are We are here. Um, I was going to say, I want to I wanna help lead. I want to get some battle experience. If we die, yeah, it sucks, but it's not so bad. So yes, we'll put a cut in here. Thank you very much for watching, folks. Oh, Castle Town just finished. More money coming in. Lovely. Thanks for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.